Hello! Welcome back to Play On! How are you doing today? My name is Jaren, and I'm glad you're here. We've got a uh, regional climate analysis complete. Abnormally note. Uh, abnormally. Okay. So we're in the antechamber. Uh, climate anomaly detected. Cool. Uh, so I don't know. Oh boy. Hello. Oh, it's so nice to so nice to be back in Chozo. It's so nice to be in. Reads reads name offhand. Chozo. Ooh, the magma pool. pool. I don't think I could do that though. I think I'm supposed to. I think that's the room I'm supposed to have uh, the grapple hook for. Uh, hmm. Hmm. There's a ice beam door in the furnace, but I don't have the ice beam. Oh, uh, well, let's see. Okay, is there anything else I couldn't do? Ah! There's... There's a... Ruin Shrine. Cool. That looks like where we gotta go! Where we gotta go is to the left of where I'm standing. Through this door, I assume. I really shouldn't assume. I should verify. Verifiably shut the fuck up. Found the right way to go. So we're going through the door. Through the door! Through the door, through the, through the, okay. So I'm gonna switch back to power beam temporarily. Just because it's a faster, uh, a faster blaster. And I need to be the fast, I need, I need to be the fastest. I'm gonna be the faster master blaster. Okay. Um, faster master, okay, hold on, let's review. I need to go down through this door. And not up to the top. Which is good, because I didn't want to do that anyway. Okay. So, ah, ah, oh, uh, uh. sorry, I'm, I'm, I'm used to panicking when I fall. Uh, uh, so, sort of a, sort of a life thing. Uh, no, I'm just, no, I just I remember there was a bunch of poison in that room at one point, and we, we like, and it's part of poison, like that. It was, it was bad. Uh, oh. Uh. Yeah, no, I'm pretty sure I can't go through the fucking magma pool. But I can go to the main plaza. To my right. Jump. Double jump. That's right. Oh, I love the double jump. Remember like 10 episodes ago when I was like still freaking out about getting the double jump? Oh, okay. Hello. Oh, so glad to uh, get to deal with those things again, huh? Oh, but look at that spider ball. Spider ball looks so cool. You could use your spider ball, looking all cool. Uh, okay. I need to go not of that away. I need to zoom out a little bit. So, that's the one, right? So, ah, doop, doop, that, okay. Yep, so I need to go to my left, to my left. Everything I know, because I'm going to the left. Uh,. I don't think there's actually a door. No, yeah, there is. Where's that door? Where's that door, I said? Uh, is it right here in front of my eyes? Ah, of course there is. Oh my gosh. I feel a little stupid, but when do we... When is that a, ah, when is that a new feeling? Here, play on. Okay. Cool. Welcome to the Ruin Shrine. Oh, this is another one. Look, it's a half pipe. I wonder. Wait. I don't have to wonder. All I have to do is... All I have to do is get wicked air. Oh, Samus is obsessed with getting wicked air. Sergey, damn it. Your episode's later. Oh, I found a missile expansion. Fuck yes! This is a good episode. 50 missiles, you see that? Do you see? That's a lot of missiles. How many missiles can you carry, huh? I don't think, uh, you know. All right, ah, 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 ooh, ah, it burns. Uh, okay, here, let's, I don't think, oh, I never did this, huh? Oh, and there's another one! Whoa, what, woo! Two missile expansions in the same room in the same episode. Oh! 
Oh, yeah. What else have we got? Who else has got some loot? Woo! Oh, this is exciting. How about that, huh? What you know about me? What you, what you know? My lip gloss is glue. My lip gloss is popping. I stay because I'm Samus. I'm blapping and I'm chopping. Ser Sergey, get out of there. You're, you're not going to... Your episode is not till later. Ah! Spider ball! Ah! I fell. Fuck! Shit! Ah! Uh, ooh, you are lucky. You're lucky I don't beat you like, you know, you're lucky video game. I don't just beat your ass. Because I cause want to show and the nice people. The nice people will think I'm a bad boy. All right. Gently now. Gently. Gently now with the spider ball. Gently. Gent, 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 gently. Tenderly. Okay. Okay. All right. Going through this door. Uncharted territory. I've never been through this door before. I could not tell you what's on the other side of this door. Except for another door. Perhaps. Another door. Alright. What's going on in here? Who are you? Hello? Hello? What is this? Who are you? Large stress fractures can be seen on the surface of this brimstone pillar. Wow, that looks lit. Let's jump up here where it looks lit. Uh, okay. Yo, how's everybody doing? Uh, hi, I'm here for the Play On show. Uh, maybe you haven't heard of me? Okay. Uh, where was the one that's worn? Hold on. I wasn't paying attention. Can you guess that? I wasn't paying attention. I was trying to talk to you while I'm doing this shoe. Okay, where's the one that's weathered and shitty? That one, way up there. Okay. That? That literally right there, okay. Well, I think it, I think it wants me to blap it. But I can't, uh... Oh, wait. I remember. Hold on. <sighs> Sorry. I know. Okay, check it out. So, I'm... I, I know, I know, I know. You're like, wow, why don't you figure this out? So, there's these giant blap things, and you have to blap. Super missile. I assume you have to super missile them. There's another one over there. You see it? Right there. And I didn't super missile it. I uh, didn't super missile it because I... Didn't. Okay, let's try it again. Uh, make sure you've got your aim and black. Nice. See, there's another one. There's another one. I don't know if it actually requires super missiles, but super missiles are doing it, so we're doing it. All right, welcome to play on Overkill. Oh yeah. Oh, I love the cutscenes. <gasps> What's that? Oh shit. That looks kind of serious up top there. Oh, uh, hello, uh, that looks kind of scary, okay, what, uh, what is this, new creature's entry, plated puffer, puffer with reinforced epidermis, oh shit, face on exposure has created a mutant strain of puffers on Telus 4, they have developed plated skin, making them harder to burst, ah, 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 okay, well, we're underwater now. I suppose this is actually probably the safest point of the room. Because while they are plated, they are still puffers. And swim can they not. Anyway, uh, I'll be doing the rest of the show from underwater, where I'm clearly safe. Uh, oh my god, my allergies are so bad. You ever just want to, like, rip your face off? Ow! Because it's so itchy! Ah! Okay, anyway. Like I was saying, doing the show from underwater, uh, where no where no enemies can uh, try and hurt me. So I'm damn it, Samus the bounty hunter, not Samus the winning bounty winning hunter. All right, that's a lot to ask. So are they plated? But does that mean I can't use my? Uh... Oh hi, can I use the? Uh... Blap? Nope, I have to blap. 
Oh, they really just... Oh, hey, like I said, we're doing the rest of the show from underwater. Ah, oh, sorry. I know, I'm sorry. You know, leave a comment. And, you know, you, have to, you don't have to yell at your T. You don't have to yell at me. Just type it in the comments, okay? That's all I'm saying. It's all I'm swing. Ah! Ah! Sorry, I got stuck. Look, okay, I'm sorry. I got a little carried away. I got, I got sailed away. Like, that's six song. I'm sailing, I'm Samus away. They call me Samus, and the sun's in my eyes. That's okay, because I'm happy and I'm sad. Because my name is Samus, and I fucked your- Ow! Oh, damn it! Ah! Oh. Was that like the sixth time I fall in the water? And I've killed two puffers? Come on. What is this? Play on? <laughs> oh. Ooh. Nice self burn. Nice self burn there. Okay. Um. Let's see. Who are you? Who are you? You think I would last longer against these fucking single puffer things? What is that? That's a different kind of thing. Excuse me. Hello, I need to scan you for things. An Oculus wall crawler that generated electric pulses. Single and I like to cool that field that covers the shit's spiders. Okay, but it's a thread or attracts us. Oh, it attracts into its little bitch ass bitch ass of a shell, huh? Oh, okay. I, I see. I see what it is. Oh, you think you slick, huh? Uh Oh, how about my fucking thing? Nope. Okay, what's up with uh, what's up with the wall? Yeah, I get it. Do I have to super missile that thing too? Oh, I wasted a super missile. Fuck. Oh shit. Ah, I didn't know to. Ah, ah. Okay, I'm fine. It's fine. Let's do one of those. Okay. You have to shoot around him? I'm about to run out of fucking missiles. Damn it! Ah, oh, I'm gonna run out of missiles! <gasps> Fuck. I'm gonna have literally like one not enough. Oh, that's so frustrating. Why do I suck at video games? Look, I, I have one. I'm literally one missile shy. Ah! Damn it. Okay. Uh. Back underwater where it's safe. <laughs> oh man. Oh, what's under here? Can I? Can I go? Th Hello? Hello? I really need missiles. Hello? I'm trying to do a show and there's no missiles. I literally need, just need one. Hello? Oh gosh, this is embarrassing, huh? Eh, sucks to suck. Sucks to suck, kid, that's what they say. That's what they used to tell me. Well. All right, bear with me for a second. Where's the missiles? Why don't you have any missiles? There's no missiles. Ah! And I just got a missile upgrade. Oh, this is terrible. I'm so sorry. Uh, uh, this is the worst. Okay. Hi. Hello. Do you have any missiles? Hello. I really just need missiles for the show. Ma'am. Uh, yes. Finally. Okay. All right. We're back in action. That wasn't, that was, that was not the worst thing. I could have been worse. Uh, I could have obviously done it better. Leave it in the comments. I'm just, I just don't care. Okay. All right. Look. Here's the deal. Uh, tell your mom that I'll be home late because I had to do fucking Samus again. Okay. Okay. Carefully, gentlemanly, carefully, gentlemanly with the spider ball. Gentlemanly, gentlemanly, gentlemanly with the spider ball. All right. I hope it all didn't reset. I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be a little peeved. Cause like, how else? How the fuck am I supposed to get like 60 missiles back? 
you know? I don't know. Okay, let's see if all the shit I did got undone. At which point, we are fucked. Um... Hello? Oh, it appears. I don't think I have enough fucking missiles. Ah! Oh, it's only three missiles for these. Oh, boy, do I feel dumb. Because I still don't have enough missiles. Why am I wasting them? Oh, I'm going to have to spend the rest of the damn episode getting missiles that I didn't have. Oh. Oh. I seriously am going to spend the rest of the damn episode underwater. Uh. Can I go up there? I don't think I can do that. Ah! Ah! I suck. Okay. Well, anyway, so once upon a time, there was uh, a child that I knew. Um, I, I didn't know personally, but I knew um, of, of him. His name is Jeremy. Um, and Jeremy was quite the kid, I would hear. I would hear all these stories about Jeremy. I would hear... Stories about how Jeremy was a storyteller and liked, uh, and did a lot of fibbing. But, uh, he always did it, you know, he did it, always, always, always put on a show. Everybody, everybody liked, everybody liked the way Jeremy, uh, put on a show when he, when he was, you know, he would just say that he would just say really absurd, crazy shit. Um, but everybody would get, you know, get a laugh and people would, uh, you know, would, people would, would laugh and that was it, you know, he'd go on. Well, this became like the foundation of, of his, uh, of Jeremy's whole personality, right? His whole life, his whole, uh, life's work, all of his shit was put around, uh, how he did this, how he told these crazy stories. So, he, uh, eventually got a job at the local newspaper. Um, cause he got so good at reporting stories, or telling stories, um, that he would start to report them, and, uh, got really good at it, got a job, whatever. So, he got, really got into his, got really absorbed in his work, um, uh, in reporting, and, and, and getting, actually, you know, real stories. Um, cause he, you know, he was, he, he thought it was important, he thought it was, uh, necessary and all that shit. So, he would... Get, you know, got really hard, hard on the case for some of these crazy, you know, deep stories he'd go and he'd do all the re all the research and all of the, uh, um, he'd go, he'd go, he'd like meet pe he'd go meet sources, he'd, he'd, he'd like do all of the crazy, like, the crazy shit, you know, that like, you, you uh, like, all of this like crazy in-depth reporting and uh, so and he finally got this crazy story once about how um, the the local uh, bee population was slowly being uh, destroyed by um, something unknown they couldn't they couldn't tell what it was the bee population that was getting destroyed uh, they couldn't tell it was it was really strange so, uh, Jeremy, the, uh, ace reporter, goes out into the field, uh, with the beekeepers, and the, and he's, like, the bee whisperer, and everybody's there, and they're all trying to figure out what's going on with the bees. Uh, and they're out in the field looking at all the bees, and they keep finding all these, uh, they keep finding all these dead bees, and they're so confused, um, and uh, Jeremy is there with the bee, the beekeeper, and the bee whisperer, and they're looking on the ground. And next to the bees, they keep finding all of these. Like, they, like Jeremy picks him up, and he's like, uh, "Beekeeper friend, is this? Is this what, like what is this?" And he's like, "Well, I think that's some sort of like, is that an acorn? It can't be. That's far too large for the bee to be carrying, right?" And it's and well, he's like, "Well, of course that can't be true," and they all agree and. Jeremy took another look and they kept walking and they kept, okay, whatever. And they kept looking and they kept finding all of these bees with all of these small, like, 
kind of acorn looking right next to him and it was you know it went on to be like this crazy fucking crazy thing crazy mystery um where the uh, bee population had been poisoned by this rogue cop who had been stung by a bee in uh, in her nose and it had fucked up her wedding day uh, pictures or whatever. And uh, so she, she was poisoning the local bee, the bees, and uh, tying these acorns to them with the poison that was killing them. And so uh, Jeremy figured it out and like went to his boss uh, with and handed him the and handed him the uh, fucking uh, headline and uh, with this amazing story it was awesome. It was so cool. Uh, Jeremy felt so proud. He did all this work and he he he, he brings the brings the copy into this uh, this boss's office and uh, his boss takes a look at it and says, uh, "Oh, you're you're fucking fired." Fires him immediately. And Jeremy's like, "What?" What he, he, he just doesn't understand, and uh, he goes home and he's all crying, uh, and he and his wife is like, "Oh my gosh, like what's what, what's wrong?" And Jeremy's like, "Hey, well, like like I, that whole project with the bees, like I worked so hard, uh, I got like I got fired because of the story." She's like, "There's no fucking way." Um, like this has to be some sort of joke, right? And and he looked at her and said, "Bees nuts, yay!" Uh, <laughs> Woo bees nuts, bees nuts, bees nuts. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, I did it. Oh. Oh, bet you didn't think that was gonna happen. What a twist. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> oh, that was... I didn't even get any missiles. Oh, damn it. Oh, I'm so bad at this fucking game. Holy shit. Okay, look. We're gonna play on next time. I'll get my shit together. I'll have some missiles. Oh, man. I can't even. Fuck, man.